And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. My name's Derek Ray, and delighted to have alongside me, as usual on these occasions, Stuart Robson. And you can really sense the anticipation in the crowd ahead of kickoff with their respective league seasons about to get underway. It's FC Goa versus Kerala Blasters. Well, the atmosphere is incredible inside the stadium, Derek. There's a real sense of optimism amongst the fans about the new season and what it might bring. It's been a long wait, but hopefully we get a great game to kick their campaigns off. This is how it looks for the home side. Well, in this shape, if their wide players stay high up the pitch and get enough of the ball, it's a very attacking lineup. But if they drop too deep, they will then leave the centre forward isolated and it could be difficult for them. And this is the initial 11 for the visitors today. Well, the shape is the same, but they may play it in a slightly different way. And key to this game will be the fullbacks. Do they tuck in alongside their centre halves or look to support their wingers? I hope it's the latter. And so the battle commences. Just failing to hit the target with his pass. And it'll be a throw-in. Well, far from the ideal pass. Space on the flank. Useful looking ball. Well, it looked like a good ball, but cut out in the end. And Fernandez. Another successful intervention, winning the ball back. Over the touchline for a throw-in. And Pereira here. It's with Alvaro. Good technique displayed. The referee's letting it go as they keep the ball. And possession given away. Rodriguez. Looking for that final pass. Looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Chance to take the lead. Really good diving stop to make sure the threat came to nothing. Well, they've been frustrated for quite a while now, but these fans have suddenly come to life. Can he deliver it with accuracy? It hasn't come to very much. A very timely interception. Well, that is how to play advantage. A real opening now. Just not looking confident in possession. It's with Rodriguez. It's with Alvaro. Well, they stopped them in their tracks.
Trying to really get at the opposition here. Can he put them in front? Yes is the emphatic answer. And you have to say it was on the cards. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. One nil then. There to take it away. So one minute of stoppage time. That's what the officials have said. And there it is, the half-time whistle. You certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, I'm sure the manager will be delighted with him. He'll have drilled it into them to keep their focus, keep playing through to the half-time whistle, and it's certainly put them in a good position to go on and win this now. Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. And Pereira here, Hernan. And back now with Pereira. It's with Rodriguez. And Pereira here. Well, there it is. The away side haven't had as much of the ball, but that won't bother them because when they win it in deep areas, they've got forward with pace and with numbers. It's been a great counter-attacking display. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. That is how to apply the pressure. So a half an hour remaining. Chance to do damage, but really sticking to the task defensively. Could be! Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. So back underway. They've levelled it at 1-1 here. A foul, but advantage played. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. And a goal it is to put them in front again. No less than they deserve. Well, as you can see, this is a wonderful strike. He makes the perfect connection, and he has so much pace on it. It's a great goal. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Alvaro. And now with Fernandes. 
unable to keep the ball that time just 15 minutes remaining he's in here well a wasted opportunity it would have been a decent chance but offside the decision couldn't keep it I'm not sure they deserve anything from this game, but there's still time to find that equaliser. And you have to say the crowd have been brilliant. They're still driving the team on. And couldn't keep himself onside. So a personnel change then. Singh. And with that, the attack fizzles out. And Fernandez. And we will have a couple of additional minutes at the end here. Fernandez. And so the referee blows for full time and it goes down as a victory for the visitors. Well, Derek, they didn't dominate the game by any means today, but overall they had the better of the chances and just about deserved their win. Well, I don't think, Stuart, anyone can really quibble about what he put into the game. Well, he obviously scored the winning goal, but it was his overall performance that impressed me most. He was on fire today.